Hello, Xavier here. Welcome back to another episode of the Terraria Modded Adventure. Woohoo! So, again, this is the third episode, but as you can see, a lot has changed. And uh, I'm about to explain a few things. So, one, uh, we, I would say we both uh, did the town, but I did most, <laughs> most of the work. So yeah, I was he, a... He was exploring, he was exploring a lot though, so, uh, we fixed some problems, so the water does not float anymore, uh, so we fixed that, stars actually fall now, uh, the mobs and bosses will no longer be spawning with 1 HP like it did last episode, those battles were kinda boring, so we're gonna be redoing some of them in this video, and then, what else was it, oh yeah, his boy is gone, because, you know, unfortunately, he he had to go. Yeah, yeah let's go. On his, his boy. He was the mod that was breaking the world. Yeah, his his boy. And then we also solved the problem why some of the NPCs weren't spawning. And as you can see, we have a good amount of NPCs now. What you see on my screen on the top right is a recipe that I want to make this episode, and it's the Elemental Forge. It will allow us to make elemental armor. Uh, and I have the required tools. Well, the, not tools. The required um ingredients to make the uh, the sand one but I need an elemental force for it so we're gonna ha start making some of these items uh, as you can see I have organized uh, the stuff right here uh, let's actually <laughs> I need some of this wow okay so furnace can be okay so I need a new furnace actually can I craft uh, can be placed material use to craft the elemental items okay uh, so, first I need to craft a new... Do I have any torches on me? No, I don't have any wood on me, actually. I think I used most of it on the uh, the buildings and stuff. I think we're going to need to get some wood, brother. Unless I can use this. What kind of wood? Uh, just wood in general. Any, I think any wood should do. Well, wait. I think I... Because I need to make a campfire so I can make a furnace. And I can make a furnace now. Okay, so I have one furnace. Now I need clouds. Oh my god. Do I really need to get some clouds? I need clouds. And I also need four water buckets. I do have some of those already, so. Let me get those four water buckets. Right there, I got four water buckets. I need ebonstone blocks. I don't have any ebons. Oh, wait, never mind. I can also get some crimson, crimson ones, uh, I believe, so. If I switch over to this one, it, I, it should be interchangeable. Yeah, I should be able to do this and then get rid of this one. There we go. So now I just need cream tain blocks. I need four cream tain blocks and I need four ice blocks, which is good because I do have some ice blocks here. Now all I need is a cloud block and some crypt cryptain blocks. So, um, which one do you want to go and find out? Do you want to get the <laughs> You want to get the uh, the cryptane blocks or the uh... well the well we have a crimson area right next door. So. Okay, so I'll, I'll let you do that. I'm gonna go and search up where I can get some clouds. Obviously, yeah. you know I know where it is. I'm not I'm not dumb, <laughs> but I have one gravitation <laughs> potion, so I'm gonna have to use that. Wish me like my friend. I'm gonna go explore well. the sky. Okay. I'm trying to get back to the um, the acid rain area. Yeah. Because I think I died at night. Ah. I'm gonna see if it actually cleared up. Oh, well, I can tell it has a different. Oh, I, oh I my death. god! What is that? Good boy. I found the uh. A a, a thing, but there's a giant freaking egg up here. Wait, what? There's a giant egg up here. Uh. Okay, stay there. Okay, spawn gonna, to me. I'm gonna complete the acid rain real quick. And then. I'll teleport to you. You know I have what? no idea what the hell you're talking about. Bro, this is crazy. I'm gonna actually do this. So we can get up here again. Well, this is a giant egg up here. I don't want to break it or anything by accident and it spawns a freaking boss, you know what I mean? Because it looks like yeah. a boss thing. Mm -hmm. Because it looks like it's been decorated to look like a bird's nest. And you'll know what I mean when you see it. 
I'm, I'm doing ropes to get up here, so uh, I'll be able to explore some more land. I do have everything. Oh, I, I found a goblin scout. Ooh, kill it. Yeah, I killed him. Yeah, I killed him. Hell yeah. Hopefully we can get the goblin army. That'd be great. Okay, so I... Yeah, it seems like everything's starting to spawn again. Yeah, I know, because everything was so messed up the uh, few other times that we we did the uh, the other videos. So I'm going to do yeah. this. And I, I know there's a island up here. So I'm going to go up top and go to that island. It should yeah. be way up here. Yep, here it is. Whoa, whoa, whoa. There's two? There's two islands up here, bro. There's usually three or four. Yeah. There's a... Okay, cool. So I'm actually going to make a little thing up here as well. With the... Uh... Oh, it's that new day, uh, that new uh, update for the Rust and Dust. Oh, really? Yeah, the Rust and Dust has a little uh, lab in the middle, middle big one, the big planet. Oh, that's always been there, dude. Really? No, I know, yeah. but the big, the big planet. Oh my God! Freaking scorpion just came out of the yeah, sky. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's been a thing. No, but I, I there's a lab in there. In the middle of the planet. From what I know, that was new from the. Uh, from the from the Rust and Dust, calamity mod. So. Come on, break, break. No, well, not break, but like, come on, place. <laughs> I used my potion already, so I won't be able to gravitate, do the gravitation thing. So, at least I got what I needed, which was the cloud blocks, which is good. And I was also able to do this, so. Okay, so I don't know. No. Alright, there I we don't go. Think it's reacting correctly because it's not spawning any of like the, the nuclear enemies but think... huh. it's not saying that the acid rain is done so yeah all right so now i need the cryptane bars so well not the cryptane bar and crypt cryptstone blocks uh can i break those or do i need to use explosives for those you should be able to break them with the pickaxe. Yeah. You have, but I have the Great Bay pickaxe, so that gives me a uh, total of sixty pickaxe damage. So hopefully I should be able to. That should be able to work. Let's see if I can. I need four of them to make the thing. So excited to try this out. Oh, okay. Okay. Well. Is this not the wasteland? There we go. It is the wasteland. Do I have to wait for the sulfuric things to appear again? Ugh. Okay, let's see if I can, can break it. That's dumb. Okay. There's no, some teleport in here. I can't, I can't break it. I'm gonna need some bombs, because I know the bombs can break it. Do you have any bombs on you? I do. You do? Oh, shoot. I have... 46. Okay, well, I just need four cryptane bars. If you can get four and then come back, that'd be great. Don't we have cryptane ore? No, not cryptane ore. Cryptane blocks. Like the actual blocks. Ooh, there's a strange plan right here. Do my fencing stuff over here. A strange plan. Oh, uh, watch out. I threw a bomb right on top of it. Oh, shoot. Yes, I got some cryptine bars. That is perfect. 
Now I can go back and craft this beauty. Now that I have everything there, I'm going to craft it. So let's craft this beauty. We have to need an anvil for it, right? Oh, works for me. There we go. Elemental Forge has been made. The nice. Now that it's complete, I can uh, uncue this. There we go. That's awesome. Now, I can actually make the armor, which is going to be fantastic. So let's make the arid leggings. Actually, me, I got to clear up some space. Like, man, I got so much stuff on me right now. So let's uh, put away some of the blocks that I got, you know. Put this stuff away. It's good to stay organized because, like, then later on, you won't have such a hassle. <laughs> uh, yeah. There we go. Got another campfire. Oh, wow. I made another campfire. Wow. Okay, now yeah. I have space, which is good. Oh, wow. Me, me, dum dum. Me, dum dum. Okay, I, I need the sandstone and the blocks to make the armor. There you go. Okay. Now let's do the breastplate. And since I'm going to be doing basically just melee, I'm going to be taking the warrior's mask. I want to make sure that's the correct one. Yeah. Yep. Warrior's mask. And there we go, my new armor. Let's see if it actually is better or if it is not. It does look better though. Oh, it's already doing me better defense, which is good. And there we go. I have my new armor, which is going to be awesome. Uh, increases the movement speed. Set bonus allow weak levitation by holding jump. Nice. So now I have a little bit of mobility. And I can just keep on going higher, right? Wow, I could just keep on going up. Oh, never mind. I, I fall after a while. Ooh. Oh, yeah, look, go up. So this leads to the planet? No, this leads to the planet. Oh. Space, I'm in space! That's funny. From what oh. I Oh Okay, I misunderstood. Oh, watch out. I was thinking like there's always a center that looks kinda like a, a, a lab. Okay, so from what I know I didn't know you meant like there's an actual lab. From what I know, when once you get into the circle, you start getting attacked by this thing. Uh so we gotta destroy it as quick as we can. Uh you might wanna heal. Yeah, apparently it does a good amount of damage. So let's that start. Two hundred. Yeah. Let's start digging down. We gotta take care of that thing in the bottom. I mean, not at the bottom. That little thing right there. What are those things? You'll see. Oh, it doesn't work then. Um. Nice. Okay. Anyways, I guess uh, doesn't do it. That that thing usually attacks. Oh, there you go. Oh no, yeah, what this this thing usually what attacks. Is that? I don't know, but hey, it's not activated, so we're good. Fuel it's... factory produces data on fuel over time. Well, that was a glitch. <laughs> oh, dude. Yeah. Don't break it, don't break we're it. We're attacking the back. Yeah, don't, don't... We're breaking the wall out. What? That's what we were doing. We were breaking the wall. Yeah, I know. But we were using a hammer. There's this thing here, though. Don't no, don't break the little daydron guy. They, apparently, you can't get it. So, from what I know. So I'm gonna break these though. So place it back down. And... Is there anything of interest in here? Or... From what I know, there's some interesting stuff. Oh, here. there's there's tons of shit. There is. Yeah, there's a good amount of stuff that we can get. But my thing is completely Lanterns. full. Nice. There we go. Um, replace the ones we grab. Freeze. Trade on log space. 
There we go. Nice. Let's see, does it go here? There you go. That is weird. Okay. But hey, look at that. We were managed to get up here, so. Please do not attempt to handle bent plasma. So there's a bunch of stuff in here. Okay, so that's cool. I guess um, we'll just leave this place for now because there's nothing I can do. We can do for the moment. Or cosmic worm. But I am gonna take this armor off and. Uh, Would you like the miss my armor or no? Um, what's its effect? So it poisons. You remember the little recharge thing? Like if you don't um, get hit for a while, you can actually um, use this little blast, a poisonous blast. Mm. Yeah, that's what it does, basically. No. All right, I shall send it. It's it's impossible to Demon Eye Banner, I have one already, so I'm gonna sell it. Okay, my friend, let's a shop and sell. You have a ball of hurt? Wow. A throwable book, Rain Meter, awesome. Let's sell this. That's gonna be really cool to have. There you go, and the laboratory panel wall. I'm gonna keep those actually. Start putting some of this stuff away and let's go fight some bosses my friend I think we're, uh, the first boss I'd like to explore uh, is the one in that new forest that I was telling you about that'll be a really cool one to yeah. explore uh, uh, and then we can fight the refight the slime and refight the eye of Cthulhu and, okay here we are finally Woo! all right so basically we're gonna want to go down over here let's where you at oh you're up there <laughs> okay, so we're gonna want to go down over here though. Here we go, it's about to get dark in here. I love the music from this biome though. Okay, oh. we gotta go okay. down here. We should probably place some torches down, I'm not gonna lie. It's a big ass fucking drop. Pretty barren. Uh, here we go. Okay, so you the see this thing? Pretty barren. We destroy this to the to attack it, uh, to fight the. Oh yeah, wormhole potions. Hell yeah. Oh yeah. How many do you have? I have one. Yeah, I have one. I'm gonna start chopping some of these trees. Maybe it might sh give me something interesting. Elk bark. Okay. Uh, so basically, we gotta break this over here, and the boss will spawn. Okay. This thing right here. Here we go. There we go. Easy boss done. <laughs> um, here's. Here we go. That that's that weapon is better for you right there. Oh. The yeah. The the set. Now we have the sacred vine, which is what the uh, that quest guy needs, uh, and then he'll give us some stuff from what I know. Uh, let's go over here more. Uh -huh. Let's go down here a bit more. This water is poisonous, like you said. Yeah. There's some more loot we can find in these areas, though. From what I know. Yeah. Yeah, but it's more in in the open areas, so we're gonna have to go over here. And then there's some interesting mobs here too, so there we go. I got a blast stone. What? I don't know where it is. 
Blast, okay, yeah. So, let's see what else I can find in this area. Oh, I found another one. Ooh, nice. Where is it at? Right okay. here. Okay, go, take it down. Ah, oh, why is it always coming after me? Okay, so we got another hook staff right here for you. Oh my god. I meant to throw it the other way, but... You've disturbed the natures. I wonder if that means it's getting harder or something. Ooh, we found the chest. I know, but I found the chest. Nice. Hold it. A four oh. oh, yeah, there's a new ore here. Um, let me... By the way, guys, we did add um, the Bane Miner, so... This is gonna be awesome. There we go, I got some four. Oh, it's a Glade Reef. Summons a Glade Reef. It can only be used in the fire. Huh. That chest looks badass as hell, so I'm gonna... Oh. A forest wood pendant increases critical chance, allows for increase of night vision in the briar. This is what it's called, I guess, the briar. Yeah, this is the briar. Okay, well, I'm gonna sell this stuff. I'm gonna... And we don't need any more wolf from stuff or this, so... I want this chest though, that chest, can I, can I please get this chest? I want the chest, give me the chest man. Okay, no, it's not, it's not budging. There is a new ore though, which is this one right here. While I, while I die, we, uh, we shall collect. What is it? It's called Florin uh, Ore. It reminds you of Starbound, doesn't it? The Florins? I guess so, but I can't even find it. Oh, it's because it's, uh, a... <laughs> Oh, there's more. Yeah, there's a lot more. I wonder what it makes, though, so I'm curious. I can't wait to see what it can make. Uh, let's, uh... What the fuck is... Oh my god, what is that? Oh, there we go. I beat it. <laughs> I was just wondering. I was like, something just starts attacking me. It's like, oh, yeah, there's a way down here. Yeah. Ooh, another chest? Hell yeah. And... And do another boss thing. Oh, the same area. Nice. Yeah, let me, I'm gonna dig down a little God, bit. Mine so fast. Yeah. Oh. I accidentally pressing the buttons I'm not supposed to press. Nice. Mining is so much easier with the freaking vein miner, oh my god. This this area is pretty big, I'm not gonna lie. I'm gonna start placing torches though. Oh yeah, you, you take it down, it's not that hard. Oh yeah, I get to see the area a bit more like this. And everybody at home gets to see it too. Bro, look, look, who, look who I found! What? I don't know. What's the stat? Uh, I'm not sure. Ooh, Brankle Cook. Uh, it just does one uh, compared to the other one I have, so. Ah. Uh. So. Okay. Oh. oh. As is. Okay. New record! I got a new staff again. There's a stronger boss though. Oh, the more we defeat, I think the more stronger this area is going to get to. I think, I think that's what's going to happen, yeah. The, the more difficult it's, it's going to get, so. I'm just starting to sell a few things that way I can get them out of the way. Oh, my, okay. Um, I got some stuff, some vanity items from him. Yeah, well, because I completed this quest. Do you want to try out the uh, the armor? How the vanity item looks? Sure. Uh, where's the other piece? Oh, here you go. There we go. Oh, cool. I, too, got the same thing. That looks cool, huh? <laughs> I, he has another quest. Yeah. 
I've been hearing the stories of a new core that's cropped up in the mushroom forests. So I'm guessing we use the sacred vines on him, right? That's what I'm guessing with. Complete a service. So you you literally just press quest. And piece for the scroll. So we need to the asteroid. The music changed real quick. Is it nighttime? Yeah, or did it? Or maybe it just got harder. Maybe. I cannot see anything now. Yeah, it's just really easy. Even with freaking um <laughs> torches, I can't see anything. I know there's another boss we can fight in this area though. Uh, I see another uh, thing. Ah, yes. Yes, I want to take down as many of those things as, as we can. For the lack of boss awesomeness in the last video. <laughs> 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 but we're, don't worry, guys. We're going to take on the slime again. So that's going to be amazing. No, he has weapons in there at all. Oh, what is this? I got a new weapon! Oh, yeah! You got a new weapon? Yeah, I got a new weapon. Uh, I'm gonna sell the vanity item, because... Okay. I ain't gonna use it at all. The Oak Spawn Heart. Right Hitting foes may cause poisonous spores to rain down. Poison hits foes. It has a 25 damage. Uh, it's not that as good as the ones that I have. What, what, what does it attack, though? Let's do this. First boss. Here we go. God damn, bro. <laughs> hey, these fighters are good. Ooh, I got a ninja katana. Nice. Got one of these paper tools. Another one of these bags. Uh, another heart crystal. Okay, cool. Uh... You opened it right on top of me. <laughs> huh? You, I think you opened your bag right on top of me. Yeah, I know. I have a full inventory. Oh, here you go. I'm gonna drop the stuff that you gave me. Here you go. Oh, broken. I'll take the There you go. So I'll I'll to gives 10% increased damage while you have an absolute rage buff. Uh, increase your chance of getting absolute rage buff. Rage mode does more damage. You're you gain rage over time. Revenge drop only. Okay, nice. You know, I'm starting to realize that uh, um, I'm just reverting back to my magic. <laughs> your magic ways. Yeah, because I'm not even using my freaking summon. <laughs> There we go, so if I right click, I can dash. Nice. Yeah. Yo, that is a that is a strong dash. Can I dash in this guy? Hell, oh my god, I can. That gives me so much mobility. It's better, better than the Shield of Cthulhu. I might use that for dash. I don't know. That might be cool. You don't want the slime pet? I mean the slime saddle? I already have it. Ah, okay, well, let me use my. I must see if. Nice. That'll be great for, like, bosses as well. So that, so that. This is gonna be interesting to use. Alright, so you ready for another BIOS? <laughs> boss and activate boss. But I will be soon. You are not doing a lot of damage. Nope. Good yeah, lord. Yeah, uh, holy crap. I melted his health. <laughs> we're, we're good on on your attack power. That's that's for sure. Hey, do you want to fight the, uh, one of the bosses? Yeah. Thanks. 
Okay, here Summoning we go. Summoning Rumia. Three, two, one. Ah, uh, Rumia, it's Rumia again. Okay, yep, that's a. Yeah. That was very uh, treasure bag. I got some Moonlight Ray. Yeah, that's her spell. That's her spell, too. Here you go. I don't know, you can use it if you want. I have two of them now. You have three of them now. I need three of them. <laughs> <laughs> ah. Wait for it. Wait for it. What the fuck? Damn this damage. I can take damage like a monster. I feel like I'm just stealing all your HP. No, no, you... It's this <laughs> weapon that just... I can take a bunch of damage. ...does everything here. for me. I leveled up, yeah! Holy crap, look at how much experience we got! <laughs> it was a lot better than the last video where we kind of beat every boss and like... One hit, except that this one, you know, we also beat them in the one hit, but <laughs> um, well, it was more like a rapid succession of tiny hits. Yeah, pretty much. Um, I never did get to show you that egg, unless you want to see it now. Oh yeah, the egg. Yeah, so let's let's see your reaction to that egg before we leave. What? I know, right? I wouldn't touch it though. Um, I, I don't know. What would it spawn or something like that? So we're just gonna follow basically the uh, the pre hard mode bosses and see what we do next. It looks like next we should uh, go fight these scarabeus, but we're gonna need some um, sapphires to get to get the spawning thing, and then we'll fight the desert scourge. Uh, I'll keep getting uh, better armor offhand, uh, but I will craft it in front of you guys, so I'll get the materials and stuff. But again, I will craft it in front of you guys. Uh, so yeah, thank you guys for watching today's episode of the modded Terraria Adventure with me and Silver. Alright, so uh, we'll see you guys next time. Uh, man, we, we have a lot we can do next time. There's a lot to do. <laughs> and I can't put my finger around it. But, um, yeah, oh, you got any suggestions? Well, how do you make a crimson altar? Uh, he said what? that's what we need. A crimson altar? Yeah. Well, we, we, we have a corrupt one. I mean, yeah, we have one. What? Yeah, we have one in the bottom. Huh. But yeah, guys, we'll see you next time. See ya! <laughs> <laughs> that was a weird cut. <laughs> Oh man, uh, Terraria's got us all whacked up already. I, I got rock. <laughs> and an RPG. Oh crap. <laughs>